Desk. If you ever want to know how much high school basketball means to the mid-Michigan community, look no further than the scene at Holt High School tonight for the Division I state quarterfinal matchup between East Lansing and Ann Arbor here on APAC. Jim was on hand as the Trojans were looking to punch their ticket to the Breslin Center. The East Lansing students certainly came out to show their support. You also had Michigan State men's basketball coach Tom Izzo and a few of his players in the house as well. East Lansing led by 10 in the first quarter but struggled in the second quarter. This bucket by sophomore KJ Torbert were the only points of the quarter for the Trojans which allowed Huron to mount a comeback. Six foot six senior Justin Lantham gets the rebound in the bucket to give the River Rats a four point lead at halftime and they kept their momentum in the third quarter. Yasin Isa connects on a three to make this a six point game. Now the Trojans love the fast break and it's because of players like Torbert pulling out a little hop skip and a do to trim the lead to four. Then with just under eight minutes left in the fourth quarter, someone actually pulled the fire alarm and the game was paused for around 10 minutes which set up EL to resume action with its hair on fire. Torbert the lob, JL Branson with the slamma jamma to get the place rocking and shortly after the Trojans swing it around to Cam Hudson and he connects on the triple to give East Lansing a one point lead. But Huron used its rebounding and clutch shot making like this three in the corner from Christian Brown to take the lead back. Ann Arbor Huron would hang on to defeat East Lansing 54-48, a crushing loss for the Trojans who fall in the state quarterfinals for the second year in a row. To me, it's not a fall, man. It's life lessons. You got to learn from this. You know, we got a lot of young kids. They need to learn from this experience. Man, I'm so proud of my guys, man. They fought hard. You know, the ball just didn't fall our way today. You know, shots we've been making all year, we just didn't make. This is two years in a row now, so just trying to use that and try to get over the hump next year. We, uh, we only have five seniors, so a lot of us coming back and uh, just, just keep working over the summer and try to get better and better so we can, we can get farther next year.